If you have mics and lavaliers like these, which have 3.5 millimeter plugs and require plug-in power, which is between three and five volts, and you wanna use those with your audio interface or other XLR inputs, then this is the type of adapter that you need. Not only do these convert 3.5 millimeter or one eighth inch to XLR, they also transform or convert 48 volt phantom power into the three to five volt plug-in power that you need to run these devices. And normally you'll find plug-in power for the 3.5 millimeter inputs on devices like phones, cameras, computers, zoom recorders, or Tascam field recorders, etc., etc. So let me show you how it works. Plug in the adapter to an XLR input, connect your 3.5 millimeter device, and I'll use this lavalier mic, then turn on your 48 volt phantom power that will be converted into plug-in power, and then raise the gain like any other microphone. All right, so now you're hearing me through this lavalier microphone, which is plugged into our adapter, and then of course plugged into our audio interface. 48 volt power turned on, that of course is converted to the plug-in power that we need to power this lav mic. You know, it's a great way uh, to use your lav mics with your audio interface for some really high quality sound with your lavalier mics. Now, another way that you could connect this is to plug an XLR cable into your audio interface, then plug the adapter into the XLR cable. So this time I'll use a Rode Video Micro, which is a small boom mic that normally connects directly to a camera. But by using this adapter, I'm able to place this mic wherever I need it and I'm not tethered to the camera. All right, so now you're hearing me through the Rode Video Micro, a camera mounted boom mic that we can now use with our audio interface thanks to our adapter. Of course, I have an XLR cable attached and then our adapter, so I can really move this mic anywhere I want now instead of being tethered to that camera. Of course, I don't have the, uh, the windscreen on there, but of course we can put that on there and record super high quality audio, uh, you know, thanks to our adapter, right into our audio interface or, you know, use it into any kind of uh, XLR input that you want with your 3.5 millimeter terminated uh, microphones that also require plug-in power. I mean, these are awesome adapters. I love them. Everybody, every studio should have at least one of these adapters uh, in, their, in their toolkit. All right, so there are different types of these adapters out there, and you may be tempted by some of these cheap ones, but just understand, these only convert 3.5 millimeter or 1 8 inch to XLR, and they do not convert phantom power to plug-in power, okay? So they will absolutely not work with devices that require plug-in power, all right? Instead, you want something like the Movo or the Rode. Now, I would highly suggest that you go for the Rode VXLR Plus, just because I find it converts phantom power to plug-in power more consistently. It's very transparent, it doesn't add a bunch of noise. It even has a belt clip, which can be useful if you're using it with a lav, and it's only like $5 more than some others out there. There's also the Rode VXLR Pro, which has a transformer that converts unbalanced signals into balanced. Also, if you need to use longer cable runs, then the VXLR Pro will provide consistent plug-in power while maintaining very low noise over longer cable runs. Now, the VXLR Plus will be more than enough for most people. As you heard, it did just fine over our 10-foot XLR cable. You know, I've even used it with a 20-foot XLR cable with no issues. But again, for the most pristine audio over longer cable runs, it's worth spending more for the VXLR Pro. And these adapters really do come in handy, let me tell you. So, you know, I really do suggest that every studio, videographer, or content creator, you know, you really should have at least one of these in your toolkit. Whether you're using camera boom mics, lavs, headset mics, or any other mic with a 3.5 millimeter plug, you know, that requires plug-in power, these adapters allow you to use your mics when you need them, how you need them, and where you need them. So if you wanna pick one up for yourself, either the Rode VXLR Plus or the Rode VXLR Pro, I'll be sure to have links in the description below.